everybody welcome back to my another video tutorial so in this video i'm gonna show, show you how to make a interior realistic photorealistic scene using blender and i'm not i didn't use any hdr image to make a photorealistic render this is uh, from zoom out is the living room and to make it a photorealistic i don't use hdr image if you if i use the hdr image it takes a long to render very very long to render and this image uh this image is very uh high to download it because i have a hdr image so it is only 2k hdr image and this file is around 16 mb 5.9 mb it is not uh that is not ideal for a very good photo very good quality render engine very good quality rendering this is my render so i'm using the default texture sky and sun position to make a photorealistic rendering you can see that it is a very photorealistic rendering so I did it with the helping of only sky, sky texture and sun position and you know, it takes a very uh, uh, not very long time to take a render so how I can set everything to to do this so let's start so don't don't need the HDR image So let's start at first uh, in this tutorial I want to show you the first important thing in the make environment and the second one the second one how to make a window glass and you see inside the inside the glass inside for glass ball cabinet and the third important thing is to how to make a curtain translucent or semi transparent uh, curtain you can, uh, you can see here this the curtain is semi transparent or you can see the translucent so first one I'm going to show you how to make an environment and then I will show you how to set uh, so render setting and how to how to and I'm mean, using the denoise technique to make it denoise so because I'm to uh, uh, maximum sample render sample I used only 200 once, uh, uh, only 200 so at first how to make a sky texture at first I, I add I added uh, sun I added the sun how to add the sun and I'm using the blender 4.2 but blender blender 4.2 is very the latest version how to add we add the sun light at the sun the sun you can see the sun property uh, change the sun color rgb 1.950.850 so sun color uh, sun color stand one angle Point zero one maximum bounds efficient node emission stand one and the background setting is background color the same background color as sun color strength stand point point six zero zero and the sky texture use the Nishita Nishita is the Nishita Sky texture, sky texture use the use the sky texture. 
and change the sun size two degree sun uh, this you can see that this setting and to make it glossy to to make a glossy reflection I use the ease glossy ray in the mix shader and how you can add a sun position first I first you add the sun position add on from here sun position or gate extension see the sun position I see when sun position this is the sun position I have already installed this one sun position sun position when you uh, already installed the sun position you can see here the already this is the sun position and in the sun object select the sun lamp from here and select the sky texture select the sky texture from here and you can use the this is the sun this is the sun show north this is the north direction show surface you can see here this is the sun rays just up elliptical way so you can uh, I have already set the longitude latitude longitude with the same location of my city And now, next setting was, this is a sun position setting. And the next, next part is how to make a window glass. because it is very important part because I want to because sunlight sunlight wants to enter inside the, the room you can see here this the sun ray comes inside the room through this glass and through this glass and through this curtain so make the curtain are semi transparent and also very important to how to make a shutter in window glass but uh, a bit different in cabinet glass uh, to window glass I, I have made the two different type of glass here so this glass shutter is very physically accurate glass shutter this is the physically accurate glass shutter to so how you can make the glass shutter first add the trans transparent shutter then add the glossy shutter and change this change this one you can set the roughness is absolutely zero numerical value zero add a mix shutter Air rate facing 0.50 and add the RGB curve and make the combined value just like this. Combined value this is a very important and this this is accuracy for window glass shutter. On the next part I am to make it static. This is showcase.
The glass summer mirror. Preview. This is the uh, this is the this is the glass for um glass for um this is a glass for this glass I have used this glass shader in in the in the this glass and insert this glass for cabinet so how you can make this glass shader just like that first uh, you have to add you have to add the add shader the transparent shader principal shader and make everything uh, set as default leave as default just change the color into black Change the color black. This is very important. And third is important how to make a curtain. And to make a curtain, so you can see here uh, this curtain is main curtain and left of the part curtain uh, uh, instance I uh, make something I have made the same instant to duplicate the same uh, same copy I have used the uh, some texture here or it is not it is optional it is an optional so change the color in a yellow color add a mix shader and mix it then uh, mix it uh, texture and color and, and again Add the diffuse PSTF and translucent PSTF and add shader and again add mix shader mix shader and add the transparent don't change anything and the diffuse color you can set the diffuse color 0 or 0.5 if you change the diffuse surface one it is better for you and add you should add the light pad and its shadow so lens uh, sun ray comes inside the room as possible as as much as possible so This is third important thing and I have make a pick light here. I will make a pick pick light and use the and I have used the area lamp here. And, and I have added the portal light just outside so it's out just outside the window and it set it uh, nearest window so go to the area at at the area lamp first you have at the area lamp uh, light area lamp scale it up adjust the scale And power on that word and check the radio button of Pluto and everything make it as default and size 2.32 meter. This is the main important thing for lights, setting a light, setting a the main important is setting a light and setting a curtain shader window glass shader and inside this shader 
and abuse the IES light you can see here this is the IES light this light beam you can see this light beam is called the IES light so how to make this uh, IES light first you have to install the IES file from internet you can get it freely or open source I've already uh, I have already installed the IES IES light I have a IES file IS light you can see here this is all IS light so to make IS light at the emission first you have to use a note click the button of the use note black body black body 5000 uh, 5600 uh, kelvin hour so external click on in here and and just select the file select this any any of this file not this one star is star is is this style of file you can get it uh, from internet uh, totally free and open source you can use it use it in your personal work or in commercial work and uh, And the second, um, and to make a very, uh, very photorealistic, uh, photorealistic, um, any scene, picture can vary to looks very good. Make the, make the uh, lighting, color, and texture light color because the color is uh, very, uh, color is a very important part of the looks very lucrative good looking uh, scene so light shade uh, the color is very important for to make your scene very good looking and and photorealistic so the next thing is how to make your uh, render setting very quick and very fast to so cycle everything make the change that you can change the viewport I don't check denoising because I have I have make a noise in the composition so to make it um, to, uh, to uh, make everything denoising noiseless First, you have to don't check in the denoise button. Uncheck denoise. So, check in render button. Denoising. So, now I ch I change the point zero two zero maximum sample 200. You can set it um, as your requirement. Uh, 500, 250. Uh, light path. Light path total. Uh, 4 volt 12 0 and transparent you can set it 24 or 22 or something like that I've set the 12 uh, indirect light 10 you styling 32 because I have rendered this uh, this scene for CPU for CPU 32 is uh, 32 is very good check the use patterns we can check uh, persistent data persistence data so uh, for color management I use HRGB AZX 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 and loop a uh, punchy loop and exposure point P0 and gamma HRGB and the next part is next part uh, this part is not a very important part so this part this part to go to a uh, view layer uh, just check the emission button and check the cryptomat material button material cryptomat under, under the cryptomat check the material button because I am to make uh, uh, because I have to make a scene a denoising because 200 sample is not good for denoising uh, denoising sample because 200 sample 
200 dpi is very very low sample but i am to make a uh, noisy mess turn into noisy mess into a uh, noiseless mess so you can see here is this is very noiseless mess no noise you can you can see any noise anything noise uh, noise here i i I cancel all the noises as possible using composition. So now I want to go to the composition. So this is the color grading. I want to show you the next chapter how to make the photo, make this scene is a very photorealistic color grading. Color grading. If I make if I if I show everything in uh, in this video, so this video will be very long. So I will make the another video then. Uh, next day I will make a, a video for how to make your uh, how to make your uh, make this scene a very photorealistic and very good color effect. So this part is for the uh, this part I want to show you this part only for uh, render setting light and uh, light setting environment settings sun setting. So this. Uh, noisy image first you have to add the no node the crypto map and you have to pick this wall as blue no color so this part is called wall denoising texture add a, a mix mix color mix color and to duplicate the mix color because it's a noise reduction. This part is for noise reduction. And uh, this for this for wall only one. Uh, this for rest uh, uh, rest of the part. So to be the mix color and connect the this one and this one to mix connect this this mix so this is the main part to denoising your noisy image this is the main part so the next part i will show you how to make this in a very good very composition this is a composition color grading process so in this part for how to how to set the uh, How to set this part this video was how to set uh, sky texture without uh, without using the HDR image sky texture environment setting a very good environment setting to make you render very fast and very good quick how to say how to set the IS light so this is the main this was the main part to make you render very fast and very good quality uh, photorealistic so i hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching see you again in the next video with a new tutorial bye bye